what I've also learned was like that the Asian American um, title the hasn't been it, it's fairly recent. I don't know if you guys do that, but it's it just came. We started using that. I want to say in the nineteen seventies. Yeah, seventy seventy one seventy two somewhere there. That's when it started to be used, and so. But the problem with the word Asian American is it's mostly referred to just East Asian, right? Mm. So when you hear Asian American today, most likely you're gonna think, oh, Chinese, Japanese, Korean, right? Yeah. And it doesn't. Yeah, you don't really think about the other um, Asian countries around there, like the Indian, like Western. Asia. Yeah, like the Western Polynesian, or even right, like Hence, the term even A-A-P-I. yeah, oh, sorry. yeah, even yeah, even Filipinos are like they don't even know what the, to call themselves because of this whole thing, right? Oh, yeah. And so, it's it's sad to see how there's so much conflict in how to refer to people because I know there's a lot of people who are like if you say, oh, you're an Asian American, right? No, you'd and then they would get defensive, be like, "No, I, I defend, I, de- I identify as like Vietnamese American or Korean American, Chinese American, Filipino American, or something like that." Right? They want to. What is it? Um, I'm blanking out. <laughs> uh, spe- specify. They want to mm-hmm. specify mm-hmm. of what they want to be, right? Mm-hmm. And so, and it even like, it, it goes in the play of how. Um, the whole the whole virus today and the whole Asian American hate, you know, it's just yeah, really sad to see that it's repeating itself. History's repeating itself. 